Hi guys. So I am hanging out on my living room floor right now. Um, I've got my little guy here. Actually, I got him set up with a TV show and a snack right now. So hopefully it gives me a few minutes. But my daughter's in school and I'm just hanging out with my little guy today. So um, I got thinking about something that I wanted to share with you guys. Um, there's a common prob problem that so many moms talk to me about. Um, it's a struggle that I've gone through a lot. And, um, and I'm currently going through that a little bit myself right now, and I'm ready to make some changes. So uh, what that problem is, is that we want to, we want to, we have all these intentions of making changes. We want to eat better. Uh, we want to lose some weight. Maybe we want to exercise a little bit more. Like we've got this in our head. Okay, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. And it just doesn't stick. So if, I don't know if this resonates with you that, um, week after week you have this intention in your head that you want to make this change um, and maybe you'll you'll do good you'll start eating better you'll go for a run and that lasts for a day maybe two and then you just fall back into old habits um, and those habits are strong and they end up controlling us so how do we um, get out of that rut how do we finally how are we finally able to make changes um, and not stick with with our old habits so um, give me a like if you are, if you're watching this now, or if you're watching this in the recording, um, if you resonate with this, if you, have you ever had that thought like, okay, I want to lose a few pounds. Um, I want to get eating healthier. I want to start exercising, but, um, I can't see who's on, but I just got a like, <laughs> it shows that somebody's watching right now. So thank you for that. Um, so yeah, I've, I've been there a lot and I'm there a little bit right now. So Personally, I've made a ton of changes in the last like five, six years. I've dialed each year. I get a little bit better. I dial in my nutrition. So it's it's a journey that everybody takes. Um, I'm still strictly gluten free, dairy free, but I get um, occasionally get into those ruts. Um, oh hi, Jalen. Uh, I need this. I find it so hard lately. Okay, so I'm kind of there with you too. So. Right now for me, um, so I, I have gotten a lot better. I'll, I'll eat some healthy meals, um, eat some salads, green smoothies, gluten-free, dairy-free, like I said. But I, by the end of the day, I have a glass of wine because I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm tired. I deserve this. I was busy today. I'll have some chocolate. Um, my thing is sugar. So I start to get, I'll start allowing myself a little bit of wine, chocolate, and then the next day I crave a little bit more sugar. And that's kind of how it works, like, um, especially with sugar, that you start to crave, the more you have it, the more you crave it. So we can so easily get into that, you get into that habit, and then your body starts to crave it more and more and more. So we need something strong to get us out of that. Otherwise, we're just going to continue doing this week after week, month after month, where it's like, okay, I'm gonna do better, and then we try a little bit, and it just doesn't work. So that's why I really wanted to share this video with you and share with you what works for me. So every, um, you've probably seen the post the last couple days about our seven day cleanse coming up. Uh, if you haven't, it's starting on Monday, April 30th. And so this is huge for me, um, and it's been huge for a lot of moms that have done this cleanse. So um, twice a year, I every spring and fall, I do, a, like, I call it a cleanse, but it's almost more like a reset. So it's like hitting the reset button on those habits that you've developed so that you can actually um, make those changes that you every day, every week, every month that you're saying like, okay, I really want to make these changes. So it's a reset button. So it's seven days. Uh, a few nice things about it and why it, it really works for a lot of moms is that it's a commitment of seven days and you can do anything for seven days. Um, it's also, it's not super scary. It's not a seven day juice fast. Um, we're not starving ourselves in these seven days. It's doable, but it makes big a big impact. impact. So uh, seven days, what else did I wanna say about that? Um, it's a supportive community. So um, if you're trying to do this on your own, if you're saying, okay, I'm gonna make these changes, I'm gonna do this and this and this and this, um, but you're on your own with it, um, it's so hard to succeed. So we've got moms, we've got, right now we've got about a group of 50 moms who have done this in the past and um, you have lifetime access, so there's tons of them are gonna be doing it again with us. So we've got a huge group of moms, um, similar situation as you that are gonna be doing this with you and um, we've got a few new, new moms already and we'll have, um, I'm guessing like a, a good group of new moms 
doing it again this time. So you've got some that are doing this with you for the first time and some who have been through this who can help um, share some advice and support. And so that community is so good um, over the seven days. We post, um, I personally post daily check-ins um, and I'll explain sort of what you'll be doing um, each day, how you might be feeling, how to overcome any of the struggles that you might be going through. And then anytime you have, you wanna share, um, people are always sharing their, their meals in there, their smoothies, um, so kind of check-ins with that, so it's accountability. And anytime you have struggles, um, post it, and then moms are commenting, um, other cleansers are commenting, giving support, and I, I'll, I'm constantly in there too, so that's huge too. Seven day commitment uh, is nothing, um, you can do it, and then, also the support of the moms and that guidance through it. So it's it's Mom. fairly intense. Mom. Here, do you wanna come say hi? Yeah. So it's, it's intense enough where it makes an impact, but not so intense that it's not doable and that it's so scary. Um, what else did I wanna say? I'm kinda of getting off track. There was lots that I wanted to say. Um, so yeah, if you've been thinking about it, if you resonate with the, that you want to make changes, but you're struggling, then I highly encourage you. Um, it's only $21 and it's a seven day commitment and you have lifetime access too. So if you're not, um, you can't fully commit to it this time, um, know that every spring and fall we do it. Um, you have access to the recipes and all the updates and everything like that. So I highly encourage you to make that step. We're not going to, we're not going to fix every single, single thing in seven days. Um, right, we're not gonna, but this is such an important um, jump start to making those changes, and it's been huge for me. So, I'm so ready to get out of my bad habits that I've created over the last few months and um, get back to, to good habits because um, I'm not sure if you guys are like me, but I look at the calendar and it's about two months until summer, so that's kind of my you know, I want to dial it in, I want to lose a few pounds. Um, feeling great, get those healthy habits in for summer. And then like in the mama recharge lifestyle, it doesn't mean that you can't ever have some chips or some wine, but if you can get for 80% of the time, if you can dial in your, your nutrition with these new healthy habits, if you can get in the habit of like daily smoothies, salads, healthy meals, <laughs> um, then you can, you know, during the summer, you can have that glass of wine by the fire, whatever you're drink of choices, or you can have those chips, you can have some roasted marshmallows, and you can still feel good, you can still keep the weight off because for the most part you've um, dialed in your nutrition. So, as you can see, I'm, I'm passionate about this, and I'm passionate about um, the effect that it has on moms, and I'm just gonna try to find um, some of the comments from just our last, I'll read out Mommy. some of the comments from our last cleanse um, mommy, that people just kind of randomly mommy, posted to me um, mommy, or emailed me. Mommy, yeah? I in a minute, okay. Do you want to come look at yourself in the camera? Mommy. You say hi? Do you want to show them your car? You show your car in there? Yeah. Okay, so I'm just going to share some of the results because it's huge. And you would think like, okay, how can you, how can you have so much in seven days? But it really is. And then that seven days, um, it continues on after like, um, the changes that you make and how you reset your palate. Okay. So, um, I'll share one here. I have to start by saying thank you, Terry, for the amazing cleanse. I was very hesitant to try this, but it has completely changed my world. I made the whole week, no cheats, and was super proud of myself. I felt amazing. I felt amazing. I had terrible brain fog and just got rot from garbage eating prior to the cleanse, and I now feel rejuvenated and ready to start my new adventure, choosing wise, healthy food for both myself and my kids. I have a bunch of new tool, a bunch of tools now in the old toolbox to continue this healthy journey. I would highly recommend this for anyone to try. Thanks again, Terry. You were extremely helpful knowledgeable and always there to answer any questions or concerns your emails and videos were very informative and motivating to stay on to help stay on track your newest follower Corey um, maybe I'll read another one or two um, so this is Joanne I find myself getting out of bed earlier and not feeling so tired and unrested I've been tracking my sleep and found that I've been sleeping better and deeper uh, than before the cleanse. And I'm loving the tea 
and I'm loving the tea and the smoothies. Um, another one I'll read is, I feel light, lighter, less tired in the mornings for sure, even happier, if that's even possible from a cleanse. Uh, that's from Morgan. So I'll, I'll uh, in the link um, that I posted in the comments section or in the description, uh, there's a few more um, comments that, that moms have said. Um, I've got also have another follower that wrote, um, who has a blog and she wrote a, a blog post about all that. So I'll see if I can find that one too and share it with you. So, uh, my biggest, um, uh, what's the word I want to find? My biggest message that I wanted to share with you today is that if you are feeling that at all, that you want to make changes, but you find that they just don't end up sticking, um, that it's such a struggle, then I highly encourage you to take the leap, um, Join the cleanse, $21, seven days, and see the results that you can get and see how you can make those changes carry forward. Um, one thing that I think would be neat, um, you know what, I think I'm going to share my before and after pictures. So I have, um, I don't really have very great pictures from like years ago, um, but I did take a picture just like months ago, like maybe about a year ago. Uh, before and then I took a picture after doing the cleanse and after the mummer charge method um, saw some changes there and then um, I want to show this is sort of my accountability at the um, end of June that so I've got two more months I want to show uh, results after that so I'm gonna really try to dial it in over the next two months and I thought it would be neat for you guys too um, that are starting the cleanse so if you want to take a picture before and then, and you can just decide what, if you want to share it or not, but just do it for yourself. Take a picture before, and then maybe um, if you see re results right away, you can take a picture after the cleanse. And then most importantly, take a picture. If you have sort of the same game plan as I do, you want to tr try to dial it in for summer. And then take another picture um, at the end of June and uh, just to see the results. And if you're brave enough, you can, you can share it with us. If not, then it's nice just for yourself. So, um, yeah, I tend to, to ramble on a little bit, so I'll probably leave it at that. I'll post below in the comments some before and after pictures. Actually, one more thing I wanted to mention, too, is that I get a lot of, in the, whether it's the seven-day cleanse or the mom recharge method or just people following the mom recharge lifestyle, um, I get a lot of pictures of skin, before and afters of, of skin. And it's sort of funny is that we can't, there's a lot of changes that occur internally. A lot of people say that they have increased energy, um, they have more clarity in their head, uh, less brain fog, um, they're even happier. But you can't take a picture of those things. You can take a picture of um, those results are visible where it's your skin, um, you see differences in that. So know that in these pictures, these before and afters, of uh, people with the, the dramatic changes in the skin that they've had, Think about the changes internally, their energy, um, just all the shifts that have, are going on internally. So these are just very small, um, change, very small symptoms, a very small portion of the changes, the ones that we see the images of the the before and after of the skin changes. So um, just know that that um, that there's huge changes, even bigger changes going on internally. So I just wanted to say that too. Um, so yeah, I'll post pictures, some different before and half afters uh, in the comments, and I'll try to be brave enough and sh show some uh, before and afters of myself, too, that I haven't shared before. Okay, so thanks for watching, guys, and um, if you want more information on the cleanse, uh, click the link in the description, and any questions you have, um, I'm, just send me an email, I'll... Uh, I'm usually around, so I'll answer answer that right away. So have a good day, guys. Bye.